hey guys today we are going to see a silo in condensation it consists it consists in it's it consists in treating a carboxylic ester with metallic sodium in large amount or a large volume of solvent in benzene or toluene followed by a protic solvent let's see a the product obtained in alpha product obtained is alpha hydroxy ketone and this is called this is called acyloin condensation see a reaction two mole of carboxylic ester in presence of sodium xylene or toluene solvent we get a product uh, C double bond C single bond OH R H this is acyloene now we are going to see a mechanism first step 2 mole of carboxylic ester we have to take step 1 plus 2 mole of sodium ion sodium radical now here the C double bond O here the homolytic fusion will take we get a R C O C to five make this O C to five is O minus N A plus. Now this dimerize further we get a R C O minus N A plus O C to H five C O C two H five this R and O minus N A plus now double bond shift here and this double bond shift here it release of this group and release of this group we get this group we release means ethoxy so sodium ethoxy release two mole of sodium ethoxy release two mole of sodium ethoxy release we get a R C double bond O C R C double bond O now 
this we get a 1 to die ketone we get a 1 to die ketone further it react with 2 mole of sodium radical we get rc see here again homolytic fissure O N A minus N plus C O minus N here plus C here this bond break in homo 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 homolytic fashion so one radical here one radical here and one radical here one radical here sodium radical is attached here now these two radicals will make a bond and further further a protic solvent so the protic solvent is used this provide up at, at H plus ion acidic acid provide H plus ion and we get a OH OH the lone parallel oxygen will shift here and this bond will shift towards the ox carbon and this H this H plus will this H plus this carbon get a negative charge when you, when you shift this bond and this H plus will come here or you can say tautomerize Totomerize, totomerization, and we get a RC double bond O, RC OH, and this H. This is a silo in condensation. Now we can take another example. Suppose we take a CH2, CH2, COO, ET, CH2, COO, ET first treated with a sodium and your toluene heat, and in second is a protic solvent. Acidic acid. What is the product? Let's see mechanism. CS two. Two mole of sodium radical. Again here homolytic fusion. Here homolytic fusion we get a CS2 CS2 oxygen negative Na plus oxygen negative and Na plus this radical in an another step this radical will make a bond in next step in next step we, we, we make a bond we get a CS2 CS2 O minus Na plus O80 it make a bond O80 O minus and Na plus this double bond shift here in this group release this the negative charge make a shift here make a double bond and this group release same here the negative charge make a bond here and this group release and we get a structure CS2 
स्लेस टू स्लेस टू सी डबल बॉन्ड हो एंड डबल बॉन्ड हो नाउ इन नेक्स्ट स्टेप अगेन इट विल रिएक्ट विद टू मोल ऑफ सोडियम रेडिकल एंड हियर अगेन होमोलिटिक फिजन वी गेट सी एस टू सी एस टू सी एस टू सी ओ माइनस एन ए प्लस हियर रेडिकल हियर रेडिकल कार्बन ओ नेगेटिव एन ए प्लस नाउ प्रोटिक सॉल्वेंट यूजिंग एस एसिडिक एसिड इट विल इट गिव्स एच प्लस आयन एन वी गेट सी एस टू सी एस टू सी एस टू एंड ऑलरेडी हियर द बॉन्ड इज फॉर्म सॉरी हियर आई फॉर वोटेड इट वॉज अ बॉन्ड हियर फॉर्म एंड द रेडिकल विल हियर ऑलरेडी इट वॉज फर्स्ट बॉन्ड एंड इट विल हियर द होमोलिटिक फ्यूजन सो दन रेडिकल हियर एंड वन रेडिकल हियर इट विल मेक अ बॉन्ड and we get a acidic acid provide a protic solvent this is protic solvent provide a h plus ion and we get a diol and it tautomerize to tautomerize to and we get a c double bond o single bond coh and h 